in the name of God, who sends the rivers from the mountains to the seas. What do the Americans think about Syria? When the Americans see Syria, they see the only mountain pass east of Israel. The Americans look to Syria, they see a river that leads to the Persian Gulf full of gas. Every part of the river Euphrates from Syria in the north to Kuwait in the south, it's full of gas and oil. When the West sees Syria, they see a river to Basra, a prized possession of the British for 100 years because it's full of gas. The river Euphrates leads to the Sea of Arab Kings in the Persian Gulf, Kuwait, Iraq, Qatar, Arab Emirates, Saudi, Oman. In the eyes of Iran, the river Euphrates is the blue road to Europe. In the eyes of Iran, he has the power of Asia supporting his back. And he is facing the west shores of Arab Kings. Americans see Kuwait and they indulge in their urge to possess it. The Americans see Iraq and say anything to get their boots on the ground. The Americans put Kurds in control of Iraq's oil because they covet it deeply. The American people were angry that the leaders went to Iraq and the American soldiers had nightmares about all the Iraqi men that they put in the concentration camps in Iraq by the tens of thousands. The Americans used trillions of dollars in bombs to get control of the gas and oil fields of Syria, which is where you will find them this morning. Americans said, Assad crossed the red line and Assad must step down. However, several times a month, it is Israel's fighter jets that are striking Assad's airports. Americans feel that Israel is the heart of Europe in the Middle East. The Suez Canal is the gateway to India. Syria has the only mountain passage east of Israel. Americans feel that Syria is one arm of Israel's strength and Egypt is the other. The Americans kept Israel afloat economically when the Arab kings would have destroyed Israel. From America and Europe in the West, looking towards Syria, the Syrian mountain pass, the riverlands of the Euphrates, and the opening of the Gulf, it is the most luscious and rich passage to the other horizons of the world in the far east. And in front of this doorway of the mountain passage stands the Russian occupation and the ocean shore of Syria, which has blocked the West from crossing into the Middle East, into India and Asia. A special thanks for the guidance from Abu Azam. Allah Akbar.